welcome, welcome guys. Episode 65, I think, something like that. <laughs> I always feel a little bit... I find I always find it out when I'm gonna edit the video. But, um... I just really found out when I was thinking about what I should what I should do in the video. I found out I found out, I just got a good a pretty good idea. But I will ask you guys if you want it. Do you want me to make montages? I know usually like sniper shootings where you have like clips. You put in clips every time you shoot a good sniper shot or, or a, a nice sniper shot. At somebody but that's usually in COD I've seen but I really want to do something interesting in Battlefield too so let me know in the comments do you want me to try to make some montages with sniper let me know in the comments I'm not a best sniper but I will try and I can do it with multiple weapons too if you want to damn So, tell me in the comments, because I will probably start to do it anyway, but like... Give me some ideas. Should I do montages? Or not? In Battlefield. Because I kind of feel, after I've seen trick shooting on videos from COD, I kind of feel that, because I have never been into COD, I played demo and I've just tried it with a friend not really been much into COD I've never owned a, my own COD game I've never had a COD game only the, the only closest thing to it is the demo of Black Ops and the demo of Modern Warfare 3 something like that I like the single player yeah That was pretty good actually, I did like three kills in a row, something like that. I felt this gun was much better with the pressure now, for some reason. <laughs> Maybe it's just me. But anyway, um, yeah, let me know in the comments and... I don't know. <laughs> I hate that I don't always talk about or usually just talks about things that comes up in my mind like I feel I should get ideas but I am not a good idea I am a creative but I'm not but that depends but also I'm not really a good idea uh, digger or whatever I should call it or idea I can I'm sometimes good coming up with ideas but I just So I just gonna I just kind of do random things in my videos, like talking about random subjects. But I might do some com. I I don't know. Should I call this commentary? Because but usually commentary is related to the game itself. Well, but uh, yeah, I just got an idea. Maybe I should like tell you guys a little bit of my history with Battlefield. How long I've been playing it and stuff. So yeah. I think actually my first... What the heck? <laughs> what? Oh, they disappeared. What the heck? That was weird. I've seen that before. That's funny. Um. Holy shit. Oh god. Um anyway, um yeah, I my, I think it was around cuz it's a little bit embarrassing to say, but I didn't get PS3 before 2011. I didn't get get myself I had on my I had internet, but I didn't know how to make online on it until 2013. I know it sounds really weird, stupid. I know it probably sounds stupid, but 
I wasn't really a very of much of a tacky, uh, except being a very loving into games. But um, it was around 2011, and I probably was getting in around that time. No, that was PS. That was and that I probably got um, yeah something like that. I was getting at least on PS2. The first Battlefield game I played was Battlefield 2 Modern Combat. I think it's one of the spin-offs of something of Battlefield 2. And it was online functionality on the game, but I never... Because you need broadband or... or a spe I think if it's not fake, you probably need a, some kind of th a little box you connect on the back and then you can use Wi-Fi. But otherwise, a normal PS2 are not made to support Wi-Fi signals. But anyway, um, yeah, and second one must be Battlefield 3. When I was getting PS3 in 2011, some maybe 2012, something somewhere around that, I was getting Battlefield 3. I don't know, depends on when it, come, it came out. But but I, did, I don't know if I did. I probably didn't get it the day it came up, but I, I don't really remember. But Anyways, um, then I was sometimes on PC playing. I never really played, made, made it, made myself be able to play. I had some problems being able to access Bro uh, Battlefield Brothers or something. No, Battlefield Heroes, something like that. I think they just. Recently, by the way, closed that game down. But anyway, um, and I have played about, but a game I also have played, but I haven't really played it that much because it was I've been this the re uh, I've been like deleting it from my PC and then uh, and re-downloading it and yeah. But anyway, I've been playing a little bit of that of Battlefield Play Free and. But in, in the main series, it's like the first game, Battlefield, uh, if the first one I played was Battlefield to Modern Combat, and then it was Battlefield 3, then it was Battlefield 4. Actually, between Battlefield 3 and Battlefield 4, I think I played 1943 and 1942 on PC. Uh, and because I have those, and I have not deleted 1943. Well, for 1943, I have I on PS3, but I've never, I haven't, and I also have, have, uh, I mean, PS3, yeah, on PC, I have 1942 on Origin. It's still available to play if you have the game, because they have deleted it from P the Origin uh, store, so you can't buy it anymore, as far as I know. But you can, ha you can, you don't, they don't remove it from your pl game list. If you have it. But anyway, um, so I can still play it offline. Uh, I think it's pretty fun sometimes offline because I can just run around. It's fun. Anyway, um, the, then it was Battlefield 4, and I think um, probably. Yeah, and I have played maybe like. Last year or something, I probably bought Bad Company 2 on PS3. I love that game. It was nice. Um, but of course, Battlefield 3 is an unforgettable Battlefield game. And I really, but I really also really like the World War 2 series. I think they should make uh, more of them, like 1944 and 1945. Especially 1944. Like, the war in the trenches of Normandy and stuff. That would be so good. World War II games, it's not very much of that currently. And they should make more of that currently because the graphics they have now would have been so amazing. In World War Two games, it would have been so amazing. I, I think it would be looking so freaking insanely good. 
And I, I'm really into World War II games. It's really cool. And I'm really interested into World War II. Like, I've been reading a lot about it. I've seen movies about it really much. It's really a, some kind of... If I can call it a genre that I've been really into. So I've actually been so much into it that I've actually sometimes been doing presentations on school where I've been making like small presentations about things about it like what tanks they used stuff like that but anyway um by the way I don't know any single thing though but I know a couple of ones but um oh shit what the heck oh there you are um Anyway, um, then it was Balfi Hardline, of course. Yeah, I think that's all. Oh, and now I'm going to probably try to get Battlefield Bad Company 2 Vietnam DLC after some time for my Bad Company on PS3. Because sometimes I play on my PS3 still. Because you know, you will, uh, you can never, I don't want to miss. I never. I, I love my classic games and my old games. Like, it's always good to go back to. But by the way, guys, I hope you have enjoyed my story. And I, Balfour is my best, the, the miss, and my favorite shooter. And by the way, I hope you have enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.